Jack Trice was born in Hiram, Ohio in 1902. He attended East Technical High School where he played football. In 1922, Trice followed five of his teammates and his former high school coach, Sam Williman, who took coaching position at Iowa State College, which is now University in Ames, Iowa. Trice became the first African-American athlete at Iowa State, participating in track and football. He majored in animal husbandry with the desire to go to the South and use his knowledge to help black farmers. On October 6, 1923, Jack Trice played his first real college football game against the University of Minnesota in Minneapolis. During the second play of the game, he broke his collarbone. He insisted he was alright in return to the game. In the third quarter, University of Minnesota players forced Trice to the ground and crushed him. Although he claimed to be fine, Trice was removed from the game. The doctors declared him fit to travel and he returned to Ames with his teammates. He later died from internal bleeding due to his collarbone injury he received in the game. In 1973, Jack Trice's legacy was renewed and a promotion began to name Iowa State's new stadium after him. In 1974, the Iowa State University Government of Student Body unanimously voted to endorse his effort. In addition, the Jack Trice Stadium committed compiled more than 3,000 signatures to supporters. President Robert Parks named the stadium Second Stadium. In 1984, the stadium was named Second Stadium, and the playing field was named Jack Trice Field. The government of student body wanted to do more to honor Trice. They raised money to construct a statue of Trice in 1987. Due to the precise of the students, alumni, faculty and staff, and other supporters, the stadium was finally named Jack Trice Stadium in 1997. Now, Jack Troy Stadium is up and is holding all the Iowa State football events.